And if you own a Subaru, you might want to keep an extra eye on it. Members of Colorado's largest Subaru club say they've seen an uptick over the last month of Subarus being stolen across the metro. And one was stolen in Westminster less than an hour ago. Denver 7's Sally Mamdu joins us tonight with more. Subarus are a hot commodity in Colorado and criminals will do whatever they can to run away with one or two pieces or even the whole car. So this is what it looked like before. For Luis Slotkin, his blue 2004 Subaru SDI was more than just a car. That was the last car I built with my dad before he passed. So it was a really important car. So you can understand why seeing his car like this after it was stolen is tough to watch. So that's what it looks like before. Okay. That's after. Wow. The hood is completely gone. It makes me mad. The damages are worth $20,000, and he isn't the only one dealing with the aftermath of a stolen Subaru car. They get stolen left and right, and they're targeting, the main years they're targeting are anywhere from 02 to 07. Levi Runsick is the founder of the state's largest Subaru car owner club, known as Simply Subies. He says in the last couple of months in the Denver metro area, there has been an increase in the number of stolen Subarus. Over 100. Over 100? Over, easily. Levi recently set a bait car outside his auto shop in hopes of catching thieves. Because Subaru is such a large um, community in Colorado, the parts are extremely, like, profitable. Charles Ole the fourth, who overlooks the club in Colorado Springs, says owners everywhere are impacted. I reached out to you guys so that we could get the word out to more people to get more eyes out and looking for these cars. In Denver, Sally Memdu, Denver 7.